Steve Hofstetter is in studio, and once upon a time, Steve actually did a couple of shows with legendary WFAN host in New York, Mike Francesa, who is signing off the airwaves in New York on Friday. It's kind of a major event. He's doing the tour today. He was on Good Morning Football and NFL Network. And so it ties and dovetails into number nine of the 12 DAs of Christmas. <laughs> It's the most wonderful time of the year. The 12 DAs of Christmas to all, and to all, a good night. From what I heard, it was a little bit more of spitting that happened. Mraz, you spit on somebody? A Roberto Alomar, all right? It's in my past. This is unacceptable that we have unaccounted for staff members due to a little nor'easter. I can't have it. Do you still feel a couple oh, years later that way? I'm not going to spit it. He ate something that comes out of the dog's wrong side. It was a long morning for me. The time is now. The place is here. And the whole wide world is filled with cheer. February the 3rd, we were on Radio Row and played a clip of Mike discussing his view from Radio Row. It's number nine of the 12 DAs. Number nine. WFAN. From the uh, Super Bowl. That's right. Trying to remember where we are. Yeah, we're in Houston. That's it. I was going to say studios. I'm like, I'm not in a studio. What am I doing? We are here on a Wednesday. As the place fills up, a lot of people here today. Um, I guess you call it Radio Row. I mean, it's just a big warehouse kind of thing. We're in. It's not like a row of anything, but it's like a bunch of, you know, a whole bunch of. It's like, it's like, you know what it looks like? It looks like the Javits Center. That's what it looks like. That's, that's basically right. It looks like the Javits Center. You had like a bunch of stations and tables and things like the Javits Center. That's what it looks like. It looks like a convention center. Well, it is a convention center, but that's what it looks like. It looks like, you know, it's a bunch of, uh, you know, a bunch of sets. And then they have a bunch of stations in one place. Then they have a bunch of sets. And then they have a bunch of stations and a couple of banners and uh, a couple of, you know, commercial banners and a bunch of Super Bowl banners from each of the Super Bowls up. Um, <laughs> great. It's not really a row, it's a warehouse. But kind of like a convention center. <laughs> like exactly what it's called. I don't know if you've ever been in a convention center before, but uh, it's, you know, it's like a big warehouse. It's uh, you know, got some carpeting, okay. It's uh, it's uh, climate controlled, okay. So <laughs> you know, you can be indoors and you're not too hot, you're not too cold, okay. <laughs> it was like the Javits Center. <laughs> Have you, you know, if you never left New York, <laughs> if you've never left your house, here's what a convention. <laughs> it's got sets, it's got banners, it's got banners, it's got sets. <laughs> you know. If, like, the only thing you've ever done is gone from your couch to the bathroom to work and back and never stepped outside of the, your house <laughs> in New York City, here is what a convention center looks like you in, have a the text message? in the inside of it. Number nine of the 12 DAs of Christmas. My favorite part, he should have gone into, like, what Houston was. Right. Been like, you know, uh, it's like a it's like a city. It's like New York, but it's like outside of New York. It's like a smaller New York, but in Texas, okay? Yeah, like if you uh you ever take like a like a shower outdoors, like it feels like that most of the year, you know? It's uh you know, it's uh like there's a uh, it's like near water, you know? It's very but hot, a, okay. But a city? Very, very hot, okay? Yeah, it's like uh it's like bigger than a town. Okay. You know, but it's but it's and much bigger than a village. Much much but smaller than a giant city. You know, it's like one of the like a bigger city, but then you go to Europe and there are bigger cities in Europe, even though like in America it'd be like one of the bigger now America that's uh like uh it's like south of Canada, you know, but north of Mexico. So it's like in the middle, I'd say, but Houston is the part that's closer to Mexico. So like well let's talk football. It's like a it's like a bathroom except with none of the fixtures <laughs> and much much bigger and there's nothing about it that's like a bathroom. But other than that it's exactly like a bathroom. It's uh yeah like if you were to picture like a cross between a bathroom and a warehouse that's a convention center but it's more of a convention center than either a warehouse or a bathroom. Uh, it's, uh, you know, exactly, exactly like that. Like, have you ever been to a convention? You know where, like, that's held? <laughs> yeah. Like, the center that that might be held in? Right. That's, it looks more like the center of, but, like, when I say center, I don't mean middle. 
You know, I mean, like a like a place, a gathering it's, place. Or yeah, that. like a place, and then it, you just be like, you know, and next on the fan. <laughs> you know, well, we're out of time here, so we'll talk about the Super Bowl another time. I think it's also partly because during the week that leads up to the Super Bowl, you're just out of stuff to talk totally. about. Yes. So in that sense, like I don't really fault him for that, <laughs> yes. but that's just so ridiculous. The idea, it's like a like a, and everybody's wearing pants. You know, like pants are. Uh, it's like a like imagine shorts but they go all the way to the shoes, you know? Like like picture shorts that don't stop early. You know, like that and that's what they're wearing. And there are various kinds of pants. Sometimes some are blue, you know, sometimes people are wearing like like brown pants, you know, like fancy pants. But I don't mean fancy pants in the sense of like someone's like rich and well to do. I just mean that they're fancy, you know, they're nicer pants. And so some people here are wearing pants. Some people are, oh, and they're wearing shoes that the pants go down to, which is, you know, some people are wearing shorts. I don't want to paint everybody with a broad brush. So there's shorts, there's pants. There's a lot of stuff going on in Houston. It's possibly, yeah. And so Houston, for those just tuning in, that's a city in Texas. (laughs) And uh, if you missed my explanation of that earlier, let's go back around and explain what Houston is again. Uh, (laughs) It's just fascinating.